Masombe yangangu nga kumba wa ndi zige msambizi. The status of a girl right now in Malawi is that he is a second citizen because the context is that a girl will not contribute meaningfully to the development of the family. And in fact, what happens when they are giving the education, they would rather give to the boy because they are saying uh, the girl will be married to the husband and the husband will take care of, 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 of the girl. Child marriage uh, in the community, some they don't see it as a problem. For example, if there's a uh, poverty stricken family and they have a girl child, they look at the girl as the solution. A girl who is lacking basic needs, she goes into a relationship and from there she's getting some of the basic needs that she needs. At the end of the day, she's forced to have sex and it, end, it ends up she becomes pregnant. The Modern Brides Alliance empowers young people to determine if and when to get married by making informed choices about their sexual, reproductive faith and rights and pursuing alternative life path in an enabling environment. The partnership in MTBA is an interesting partnership. The local organization, the partners from the south, are learning from each other while also learning from the north. However, the northern partners are also bringing in the capacity building that is required for the internal institutional growth, which is good for the future and also for sustainability of the programs. The first strategy in dealing with the ending child marriages is the informed decisions. And in this one, it's helping the girls with adequate information that will help them to make an informed decision in terms of what they need to do as to when they can have children and when they can get married. We've conducted a number of trainings uh, in the community girls club that we have. These are financial education trainings and then sexually productive health trainings. And when they have the information, it makes them uh, feel empowered. Program MTB and it and it's a friggin' that zero. Could in Gazette is a banji from Mwanga, or soon to see when Temini, Dugwanga Zogunana, Kabina Maganis, or in Duganizajan, could in the zoo in the The, the second strategy is the alternative life path, which ensures that uh, even when the girl gets pregnant, is given opportunity to make sure that gets back to school and continues with her education, and also providing the economic and livelihood activities to ensure that they are continuing earning a living as they continue with their lives. Kuzia mu project ya FTBA ni ngu ya ngu bureka ku drama ni bu ngu amba business ino ni ba mapani ya kulisa popcorn. And then finally, the issue of a neighboring environment, which looks at how we can make sure that at community, district, and national level, the environment is conducive for the girls not to be married in an uh, uh, area than expected. Who marries these girls? Who impregnates these girls? It's boys and men. So they need to be involved to be part of the solution. That is why we've trained male champions in the communities. These are selected role models in their various communities and they have been trained to support the rights of the girls. I think I'm a male champion. 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 I
I'm happy now, Mogunga, as a bamba mina, I can also go in the white Sigana, would now also, I see a bangers in the same area. Magamoda, I now up to the school. If you know, Gonga is bambo, was my champion, Carelo, not to overbang the mezzo, and they don't put the residents of the eye, is in the disease of Wino. Not even to Mozi, one also one is a Sigana. Mamma, no one did him for the Mumozi, or be so that's That change in the law has a huge impact, both positive, where we are seeing a lot of progress, people being afraid of the law, and also action being taken when a child has been married. But we are also seeing a backlash when it comes to the issue of implementing that law. It's very important that we should bring this law to the common person by not looking at it as a law that is just prohibiting for the purposes of prohibiting, but addressing what are the advantages of not marrying the girl child area. And that is where the issues of community awareness, working with local leaders, becomes an important component. We have to make sure that young girls and boys have access to family planning methods to ensure that they are protected from early pregnancies which lead to early marriages. Some parents think that family planning is for only the married girls and that's very unfortunate. Family planning is very important especially for the unmarried girls because these ones are still in school. So for them to stay in school they need to have access to family planning so that they can prevent unwanted pregnancies. We can hinder their education. Undazi, the Nima Sombe Yanga with the Pondas and Sanilia Shibuezi, Nizi de Ogbrisi and Jitukulela, who was in the Vikiri, Kundumbu, when he saw Kumate and Gaupa Silan of Angonan. That is one of the things that makes me happy to see a girl being empowered. Because if we can have many girls who are empowered like that, I don't think we'll have child life. Because they'll be able to stand up and say, No, I don't want to get married. So my dream is that in 10 to 15 years from now, we should not be talking about child marriages in Malawi. It should just be an instinct that everybody says no to child marriages. One thing I would say is marriage is no child play. And we all need to come together to give the girls the bright future they deserve. I am more than a bride. I am more than bride. We are more than brides. I am more than brides.